The silence of deep space has just been broken. What if an interstellar object whirling through our solar system is actually a nuclear-powered spacecraft? We thought the main event was 3I Atlas, an interstellar comet on a historic journey through our solar system. We were wrong. The real story, the one that has scientists speaking in hushed, urgent tones, is about what's following it. It doesn't look like a very common thing, and we've never seen such a thing. New data confirms a group of unidentified objects, some potentially half a mile wide, are performing impossible maneuvers around the comet. We have a bunch of comets right now flying into the inner solar system. This isn't a natural occurrence. This is something new, something unexplained, and it's happening right now, raising an alarming question. Are they just watching or are they waiting? The discovery that changed everything, the vast emptiness of space, a canvas usually painted with the predictable arcs of comets and the steady glow of distant galaxies, has just revealed a brushstroke of pure, unadulterated mystery. For a while, the interstellar comet 3I Atlas, a relic from another star system, commanded our attention. Its journey through our solar system was a rare and exciting event, offering a glimpse into cosmic neighborhoods far beyond our own. The name itself, Atlas, comes from the Asteroid Terrestrial Impact Last Alert System in Hawaii, a robotic survey designed to spot near-Earth objects. The irony is that it found something from much, much farther away. Scientists, and indeed many people crazy about space, tracked its icy core, measuring its tail and celebrating its unique trajectory. But not all things are what they seem. And the thing nobody tells you is that this solitary journey was actually a prelude to something far more extraordinary. Recent observations processed by powerful telescopes like the Hubble Space Telescope and ground-based arrays across the globe have unveiled a truly astonishing development. What was once thought to be a lone interstellar visitor, 3I Atlas, now appears to be the gravitational anchor for a group of strange, uncatalogued objects. To put it mildly, these are not ordinary space rocks. Initial reports, which sent a jolt through the astronomical community, highlighted their unusual movements. They aren't simply trailing the comet. They are performing precise, almost orchestrated maneuvers. Imagine a flock of birds not just following the wind, but executing complex aerial dances around a single larger bird. That's the closest earthly analogy to what's happening in the cold, unforgiving expanse of space. The sheer scale of this phenomenon is astounding. These objects, estimated to range in size from several hundred feet to nearly half a mile across, are not tiny fragments. To give you a sense of this, a half-mile-wide object is roughly the size of the Empire State Building laid on its side, weighing millions of tons and moving at incredible speeds. What makes this even more baffling is their number. Early data suggests there are at least five, possibly as many as ten distinct objects all exhibiting these peculiar flight patterns. This isn't a coincidence, this is a pattern, and patterns in space usually mean something significant. The most shocking fact is that their velocities and directional changes defy simple gravitational explanations. They appear to be actively adjusting their courses, a hallmark of something controlled. Consider the orbital mechanics we understand. Comets, asteroids, and planets follow well-defined paths dictated by the gravity of larger bodies like the Sun. Even smaller fragments, when ejected from a comet, tend to disperse over time. But these new objects are maintaining a remarkably tight formation around 3I Atlas, almost as if they are purposefully accompanying it. This level of sustained non-gravitational interaction on such a scale has never been observed before. What many overlooked is the subtle yet consistent deviation from expected Newtonian physics that these objects display. Their presence, coupled with their behavior, points to an enigma that transcends our current understanding of celestial mechanics. If these objects are natural, then our models of comet formation and interstellar dynamics need a complete rewrite. The comet itself, 3I Atlas, first spotted by the Atlas telescope, was remarkable for its perfectly hyperbolic orbit, a clear sign it wasn't from our solar system. It came screaming in from the black, traveling at an astonishing speed of about 100,000 miles per hour making it one of the fastest objects ever detected passing through our neighborhood. For something to keep pace with it, and then to maneuver around it, that's a whole different ballgame. The light signature from these objects also presents a riddle. While difficult to analyze given their size and distance, 
preliminary spectroscopic data indicates a composition that doesn't perfectly match known cometary fragments or typical asteroid material. This hints at something perhaps more dense or even artificially structured. It's a truly chilling thought. The idea that something non-natural could be traversing the interstellar void right alongside a comet. You can see this everywhere. The quiet urgency in scientific reports, the guarded language, the sudden surge in telescope time requests. Something is definitely happening out there. This discovery challenges the very notion of what an interstellar object is. Previously, we had objects like Oumuamua, a cigar-shaped visitor that tumbled through our system, generating its own share of theories. But even Oumuamua's odd acceleration was eventually attributed to natural outgassing, albeit unusual. These new objects, however, exhibit a level of control that seems to transcend mere physics. These inexplicable movements open up a universe of questions, a pattern in the void. The baffling movements of these objects around 3i Atlas aren't just a minor anomaly. They represent a fundamental challenge to our long-held understanding of orbital mechanics. In the vast vacuum of space, the primary forces at play are gravity and inertia. Objects follow predictable curves, speeding up as they approach massive bodies and slowing as they recede. The data from these unknown companions shows deliberate, sharp turns and sustained velocity changes that defy gravitational explanations. It's as if they are actively navigating, not passively drifting. Many people are crazy about uncovering the truth, and this is where the detailed trajectory analysis becomes crucial. Imagine trying to predict the path of a bowling ball purely by its initial throw, only to see it suddenly swerve mid-lane and then accelerate. That's the kind of unexpected behavior we are seeing. For instance, observations have recorded instances where one of these objects, perhaps 500 feet in diameter, changed its vector by several degrees over a span of just a few hours. To achieve this naturally, especially at speeds exceeding tens of thousands of miles per hour relative to the sun, would require a significant gravitational interaction with an unseen massive body or a colossal expulsion of material, neither of which has been detected. The thing nobody tells you is that even tiny nudges require immense force in the vacuum of space. To change course so dramatically suggests a propulsion system of some kind, yet there are no visible plumes, no outgassing, and no heat signatures consistent with any rocket technology known to humanity. It's a complete ghost drive. What many overlooked is the consistency of these unusual movements. It isn't a single, isolated incident. These objects, whether three, five, or even ten of them, appear to be performing these non-gravitational maneuvers in concert. One theory gaining traction, despite its outlandish implications, suggests a form of gravity manipulation that is not natural but engineered. Could these objects be utilizing some advanced form of propulsion that allows them to interact with the gravitational field of 3i Atlas in a way we don't yet comprehend? This would require technology far beyond our current capabilities, a truly mind-bending wow factor. Consider the precision needed to maintain formation around a comet moving at such interstellar speeds. It's like trying to keep five tennis balls perfectly spaced while they're all rocketing down a highway at 100,000 miles per hour. The scientific community has meticulously ruled out known natural phenomena. Solar radiation pressure, while capable of influencing cometary tails, simply doesn't explain the sustained, direction-changing movements of solid objects weighing millions of tons. The gravitational pull of distant planets or even the sun itself has been factored into the models, yet the discrepancies persist. To put it mildly, this is not just an error in measurement. It's a profound puzzle. The most shocking fact is that these objects seem to be demonstrating an awareness of their position relative to 3i Atlas, adjusting their paths as if to maintain a specific arrangement. It's a cosmic ballet, but one where the dancers are writing their own choreography, not merely following the conductor's baton. Further analysis of their light curves, the way their brightness changes over time, provides another tantalizing clue. Some show subtle rhythmic fluctuations that could indicate a smooth controlled rotation, but others exhibit more erratic patterns that might suggest tumbling or even irregular shapes. If they were purely natural formations, one would expect a more uniform light signature over time. The irregular patterns could hint at complex structures or even multiple components within a single object, making their coordinated movement even more perplexing. You can see this everywhere in the hushed debates among astrophysicists, the frantic recalibration of sensors, the sleepless nights spent poring over data. The universe, it seems, has decided to pull back a curtain and show us something truly extraordinary. The vast distances between star systems mean that 3i Atlas and its companions 
have likely been traveling together for thousands, if not millions, of years. The notion of natural objects maintaining such proximity and coordinated movement over such timescales, through the chaotic gravitational fields of various star systems, stretches credibility to its absolute breaking point. If gravity isn't in control, then what is, not made by nature? The question of what these objects are, beyond their baffling trajectories, leads us down a path of truly profound speculation. If they are not natural formations, then their origins become the central enigma. The interstellar nature of three I atlas means these companions have journeyed with it from another star system, potentially crossing vast stretches of the Milky Way, a distance that could easily be tens of thousands of light years. You see, this isn't just a trip around the block. It's an epic voyage through cosmic history. Many people are crazy about the idea of life beyond Earth, and this discovery fuels those desires like nothing before. Could these objects be a form of technology? The idea of spacecraft immediately leaps to mind, but the term itself feels inadequate for something of this scale in apparent antiquity. Perhaps they are probes, or even remnants of a vast, ancient interstellar civilization that once explored the galaxy. The sheer number of objects, at least five, potentially more, suggests a level of industrial capacity or intentional deployment that is truly astounding. If a civilization sent out such a fleet, it would imply resources and technical prowess far beyond anything humanity currently possesses. A truly unbelievable thought. To imagine building and deploying objects of this size to escort a comet for millions of years is almost beyond our comprehension. The thing nobody tells you is just how difficult it is to detect objects of this size in the dark, cold vacuum of interstellar space. Even within our own solar system, tracking smaller asteroids is a monumental task. The fact that these companions were only detected now, despite advanced observational techniques, suggests they are either incredibly dark, non-reflective, or perhaps deliberately designed to be stealthy. Their seemingly erratic light curves, as mentioned earlier, could be a form of active camouflage, or simply the tumbling of unusually shaped structures. To put it mildly, it's not a stretch to consider that they might not want to be easily found. The most shocking fact is how long they have likely remained hidden, right under our cosmic noses, as 3 I Atlas made its way towards us. What many overlooked in previous interstellar object sightings like Oumuamua was the possibility of companions. The search for extraterrestrial intelligence, or SETI, has largely focused on radio signals, but what if the message is in the physical object itself, or in the way objects move together? These companions to 3i Atlas could be a form of passive techno-signature, a subtle but unmistakable sign of intelligence at work, etched into the very fabric of their trajectories. It forces us to redefine what we're even looking for when we search for evidence of advanced life. The idea that we might have missed such signs before is humbling, and frankly, a little terrifying. You can see this everywhere in the re-evaluation of old data, the new proposals for how to conduct SETI. Are these objects autonomous drones? Are they carrying something or someone? Are they simply ancient, derelict artifacts coasting on the momentum of a mission that ended eons ago? The Comet 3i Atlas could be a power source, a shield, or simply a convenient vehicle for crossing the interstellar void without expending much energy. Perhaps these objects are hitching a ride, using the comet's gravity and outgassing to help navigate or protect themselves from cosmic radiation over millions of years. This isn't science fiction anymore. This is a real-time observation that challenges our place in the cosmos. We are no longer just looking at a comet. We are potentially looking at the calling card of an intelligence far older and more advanced than our own. But what if their destination is right here? As this interstellar convoy ventures deeper into our solar system, the question shifts from what are they to where are they going? The trajectories, while controlled and unnatural, are still bringing the entire formation, comet and companions, on a path that will cross the orbits of our own planets. This elevates the situation from a scientific curiosity to a global emergency. The silent approach of these unknown objects has triggered a quiet but frantic response behind the scenes. The universe has sent us a message, not in radio waves, but in motion. Are these objects explorers, relics, or harbingers of something else? Let us know what you think in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates on this incredible story.